What's going on guys? Mason Santos here, AKA DJ Finesse, the crowd favorite. And today is September 15th, 2022. Now, what's significant about that? Maybe nothing, but for me, it's two years ago that I wrote this book and published this book, it's on Amazon. So today is the second year, the second anniversary of me publishing my first book, From Personal to Purpose. And again, thank you to all my friends, all my family, all my loved ones, even strangers, who picked the book up and give me amazing reviews on Amazon. Now, here's the thing, guys. I'm not doing this video to sell more books. When I wrote the book, I had no intention of becoming an author. I wasn't thinking about being a bestseller. I really felt like I had some, some information. I had something that was worth saying that I felt people would get value from, in whatever capacity that is. I felt that there was some value here in the words that I wanted to get off my chest. What this is not, guys, this is not a book about DJ Finesse what I've done and where I've been and, and that lifestyle and you know all that, it's not about that. This is a book about personal development, about struggle, about courage, about pushing through, motivation, inspiration, that's what this book is. And I got on here to tell this quick story. Um, so I met this young lady um, some years ago and I see her quite often. I could tell that there was just something, something was wrong, something was off with her. And so I offered her my book and I said, hey, listen, here's a book, you know, take the book, read it at your leisure, take your time. Hopefully something in this book resonates with you. Maybe it'll give you some, some insight on how to move forward in your life. And I saw her about two days after I'd given her the book and she told me that she couldn't put the book down. And that was again, you know, I guess for any author, I mean, that's, that's great that people could start reading your book and not want to put it down, right? So that was great for me. And I told her, um, you know, the chapter I like the most is, you know, the surface mindset. And I said, um, she said, well, I've, I've gone past that. It's a really good chapter. She goes, but I really like the chapter about that's called New Life. And I won't tell you what that chapter is. Pick the book up and read it yourself and see if you get some value. But I saw her again and she said, I'm just about done with your book. Now, this has been literally almost a week, um, maybe seven days that she's had the book. So I'm just about done with your book. And she said, your book inspired me to do something really big. I said, well, what do you mean by like really big? I don't know what that means. And she said, three years ago, um, I was the victim of a sexual assault. I was like, wow. And she goes, I just want to tell you that by reading your book, you've inspired me to, to move forward and not just tell my story, but to let the authorities know what had happened. And I was speechless. I mean, I did everything from like, you know, tearing up because I felt like she at that moment, I told her, I gave her a big hug. I said, you're the most courageous person I've ever met. Cause I don't know what that's like to go through, you know, a sexual assault and the emotions that come with that. And, you know, the feelings of guilt or, you know, it was my fault, what did I do wrong? Or, you know, I know that from that assault, you know, comes a myriad of issues. And I know she was going through anxiety and had an eating disorder. And the fact that something I wrote in this book gave her the courage to come forward and tell her story. And, you know, it's, it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a journey, right? Cause we're not sure what's gonna happen from that story. But the fact that something in here gave her the courage to tell her story. And guys, you know, there's an excerpt in here and that says, I did not write this book for me. I wrote this book for you, the reader hoping that something in here will allow you to push through whatever barrier is holding you back. And to think that this was, right, her breakthrough, that this book helped her break through and start to get rid of that, that pain and, and that heavy weight and that baggage that's on her shoulders. And I couldn't be more proud of her um, for having the courage to, to just, you know, push through and find some solace and find happiness and start to truly live her life and not live in fear. So guys, you know, on September 15th, again, I'm just saying thank you to all those who read this book. You know, if you pick the book up, it's on Amazon. Again, I truly hope that any new reader finds some value and that it allows you to push through whatever the, whatever's holding you back from living the life that you deserve to live. This is DJ Finesse. Love you guys. Thank you for all the support. All right, Finesse Your Lifestyle. And um, I'll see you guys soon. All right, peace.